Medical markets are increasingly concentrated. This means that patients are more likely to be treated by physicians at sites owned by hospitals and health systems. This raises a policy concern that the increasing concentration of medical providers may lead to higher payments for medical care without corresponding improvements in patient outcomes. This analysis is the first in a line of proposed studies examining how the growing consolidation of medical providers affects care delivered to workers with injuries. In particular, it shows how payments for care provided by physicians to workers with injuries changed after hospitals and health systems acquired physician practices. For those who are interested in major findings, the executive summary provides high-level information about the main takeaways from this analysis. For those who are looking for more information, let me show you what you can find in the study. Chapter 2 shows multiple measures tracing changes in consolidation of medical providers. We discuss measures of vertical and horizontal integration and suggest possible implications. The data and methods are discussed in Chapter 3. In Chapter 4, the authors discuss the effect of vertical integration on payments for medical care. They show measures capturing various dimensions of payments and highlight estimates for multiple types of providers, including primary care physicians and orthopedic surgeons. They also show the effect differs widely based on fee schedule regulations that were in effect in the state. We hope you found this video helpful and will download the report. If you did like this video, please click on the thumbs up button below. Also, please make sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest research and discussions about important workers' compensation topics. Thanks for watching.